Well, welcome back and happy Friday. Made it through the work week and as we ease into the weekend, looks like some decent weather. Uh, for us here in the twin tiers, starting off with first warning Doppler radar and yeah, we still have some leftover clouds, especially across uh, the Finger Lakes and southern tier of New York. But again, it was all about location today. If you were watching from or if you were down in the northern tier of Pennsylvania, that's where we had the most sunshine. But you can see on radar, no precipitation and it will remain dry area wide here through the overnight period, and probably through the next seven days. So uh, no big issues weather wise here in the foreseeable future. Partial clearing, that's what we're calling for overnight tonight. If not, tomorrow morning we will start to break out into that sunshine. Uh, calling for a mostly sunny weekend. No big storms on the horizon. Some of the computer models indicating, well, one storm pushing off the mid-Atlantic coast uh, next to Thursday or Friday. Even if that were to impact our weather, it's It'll be too warm for any snow. It would just be some scattered showers, but at this point we're only forecasting some increasing clouds towards the end of next week. 42 in Wellsburg, 40 right now in Spencer, 39 in Watkins Glen, and 37 the current temperature in Howard. You can see all the clear skies down towards the south and west and the cloud cover locally trying to whittle away a bit. It's going to take some time though for the drier air to mix down to the surface. Probably not happening until tomorrow morning or late morning uh, over the Finger Lakes region, but we'll break out in some sunshine here as we progress through the day uh, on Saturday. In the meantime, just some leftover clouds here for most of the viewing area and temperatures easing off through the 30s and into the upper 20s. 42 currently in Elmira, 45 in Williamsport, right at freezing in Bradford and 42 in Altoona. So through the overnight period, lingering clouds, perhaps some breaks, especially over the northern tier. More sunshine developing through the day tomorrow. 50, the five degree guarantee, so about 10 degrees above average. Future track, been having some issues here trying to paint some snow on the map. Basically, all this is is some low level moisture in the form of some low clouds, and that should be about it. But those clouds will break up tomorrow morning, and we'll be looking at increasing amounts of sunshine again. Temperatures making a run at 50 degrees, uh, mainly clear for tomorrow night. And then for the second half of the weekend, again, ignore these flurries that try to pop up. A lot of sunshine for Sunday. Temperatures low and mid 50s. So Sunday, the warmer day of the two this weekend. For today, we forecast 45, and that was the unofficial high at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport. Upper 20s to around 30 tonight. 50 tomorrow's five degree guarantee. First warning, seven day forecast. Smooth sailing right through the period. Looking at temperatures in the 40s for most of next week with dry weather. Again, we should be around 40 degrees or so for a high, so I don't see any 30s for high temperatures on that seven day forecast. I truly cannot believe it is December, Joe. I heard that uh, some folks were golfing today. Uh, you know, I mean, incredible. that is an extended season. Hey, if season. you can do it, then go. Why, Why not? not? Right, absolutely. Absolutely. Wonderful. I mean, I'm happy, but I'm sure there's a lot of people that want to go skiing and snowmobiling yeah. and all that. Hopefully so. that'll come sooner or later, but for the time being, we'll golf instead. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Joe. <laughs>